this new technique was developed in Argentina. Uh, the surgeon who developed, uh, his name is Abramson, he's an adult surgeon. Dr. Abramson had come to Norfolk to the uh, course that we give annually in how to correct pectus excavatum uh, and returned to his home where uh, he devised this operation for pectus carinatum. He did present his technique last year in Buenos Aires. Nas uh, was there also and, and we, we saw the technique together. So after that I started doing uh, some cases. In, I did the first case in Venezuela, the second one in Guatemala, and then I did three more cases in my country. Dr. Nas and Dr. Kelly, they, they, they invite me to come here to help them in these first procedures. So Dr. Kelly went to my hospital in March, and we did a case together in my hospital. So after that, he invited me to come here. We're pleased to be able to offer this operation here because uh, we have developed over time, over a significant period of time, 10 to 20 years, uh, ex expertise in management of chest wall problems. And this is a natural outgrowth of the operation devised here in which we have the world's largest experience in. This adaptation, I think, is something which we'll be uh, pleased to uh, be able to bring to patients with pectus carinatum. Since this operation is just so much less invasive than the former procedure, which involved uh, taking out uh, sections of the cartilages, connecting the uh, sternum or breastbone and the ends of the ribs, uh, and then remodeling the sternum, frequently by creating a controlled sternal fracture, and then putting a bar in behind the chest. It was so scary, it was so aggressive. You need to take out many ribs, large incisions, uh, Long, uh, very large, uh, long surgeries, three or, three or four hours. And with this procedure, it's just one hour, and you, have, you don't have to take ribs out. You don't have to cut the sternum. You don't have to make visible incisions. Just so obviously less uh, invasive a procedure, we think it's something that should surely be uh, uh, made available.